Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see from the title of this video, I'm starting to change things up a little bit. My channel is kind of evolving. I'm starting to move more into doing fun makeup things. Today we are filming full face of makeup using liquid lipsticks. So I got this idea from James Charles. I recently watched his video, which I will insert below. Um, basically he does pretty much a full face of makeup using only liquid lipsticks. Um, obviously his collection of liquid lipsticks is probably much more substantial than mine. I have all of these ones here. Um, and I don't know if you can kind of tell, they don't have a lot of um, color variation because I tend to stick towards the more like mauve pink colors. Those look good, I mean. So this is gonna be interesting. I'm gonna cheat a little bit um, as far as foundation and stuff goes, but I'm gonna try and do majority of my makeup with liquid lips. I don't know why I'm talking with my fingers so much, but probably because I just got my nails done. Show those puppies off. Show this puppy off. And by puppy, I mean cat. Very important. Besides moving my channel to be more makeup related, um, it's actually going to be going in a makeup and sort of other direction, um, which I will tell you at the end of the video if I actually remember to do that, because um, I have a very kind of exciting announcement um, to make. So if you stick around, you will hear that. Let's get right into the video. So I'm starting with foundation. I'm gonna use the Lancome Taint Idol Ultra Wear. My French accent's really bad, even though I took French, oh my God, up until grade 12. So oh, now that my base is on, I would generally move on to contour. So I think the closest color is gonna be, oh God, um, a Kylie Cosmetics Coco Collection in Clo Money. Um, this is really not usually what I would uh, use to contour my face, but this is kind of the closest thing. So let's just try this and see what happens. Wish me luck. Uh, let's just try and buff that out. Definitely a color. So obviously liquid lip strip, lip, it's gonna be way too hard to say this so many times. This stuff dries down really quickly, so I'm doing it in sections because I don't want it to completely dry down, so then I can't buff it out. Um, and yeah, let's try this. Oh god, my hair's getting in it. Looks like I have a really bad sunburn. It's not really picking up on camera as bad as it is in person, but I am very red right now. I look like girls who use blush as contour, which is like, no. Let's just keep going because we're committed at this point. Uh, also just want all of you to know how gross it feels to put liquid lipstick on your skin. That's not your lips, because it's not a good feeling. It's very sticky and it's not meant to go, go all over your skin, so I will be washing this off promptly after I'm done so it doesn't make me break out. Oh, fuck. 
try to do the nose. Why not? Looks so sunburned. Uh, help. I just look sick. Oh, I have a cold and I've been wiping my nose too much. So I don't think I'm gonna bother with concealer. Actually, I need to because I'm so red. Um, I just got the Tarte Shape Tape. We don't have this in Canada, and I was just down in Orlando and went to Ulta for the first time, which was life-changing. This is an Ulta exclusive product, and it's like the holy grailer of... Holy grailer? Holy grail of concealers, um, but you already know that. So I'm just gonna use a little bit of this. It goes a long way. I'm gonna use a foundation brush for this, even though I know it's wrong, so don't come for me, you know? is sun-kissed. I don't know if you can tell as much, but in my mirror, I look crazy. Why do I always do this? Am I just trying to like... Don't you like punch someone when they look at this or something? Wasn't that like a thing in middle school? I don't know. Next. Frick, eyebrows. I didn't really think of that. Um, we're gonna use Gorge, which is also part of the Coco thing. It's like a... It's like a burgundy, um, and I have red hair, so this seems legit, right? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna use like an eyelash mascara applicator for this so that I can kind of flick it into my brows. So I'm just gonna put a little bit on here. This is not gonna be good. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Oh my god. Oh no. I don't even know. I don't even know what to say right now. Oh my god. Honestly, I'm not mad. If I was like someone who went to like raves or something, this would actually be a great idea because it it's gonna lock my brows in place and also it gives them like a fun color. So maybe if I was into like <laughs> Coachella 2019, then maybe I would do this like IRL, but um, I'm not. So, but here are my brows. You're welcome. Now let's do eyeshadow. Um, I think for that, I tend to always wear like warm colors. And luckily I have some of those in lip stuff. Kylie Cosmetics number 22. Coco in oak, which is like a hot pink. It's actually called that, I, you have to say it like that, so it's a rule. Let me really just mix things up a little and do a pure red in Kylie Mary Jo. Obviously I have a lot of Kylie stuff and a couple Sephora ones. Um, let's try these three and just do like a little bit of a rainbow. Start with the uh, number 22. Oh, this is so, this just feels so wrong. These are brand new brushes. I literally haven't used these yet, so. Let's see how this goes. No! Ah. Okay, she's blended. Ish. Absolutely crazy. I'm gonna go in with that oak shade, the hot pink. I'm just gonna use the same brush because this brush is already messed up anyway. And we're gonna put that kind of on the crease. Fucking Jesus. Why did I do this? I'm so bored. Am I beautiful yet? Mary Jo, the really pure red. 
Honestly, I think my makeup from my drunk video is gonna turn out so much better than this one, which is really saying something. Stunning, beautiful, amazing. I love it. We're gonna take it under the eye a little bit using number 22 again. It kind of burns. I don't think this is safe to put by your eyes, FYI. I know that some makeup lines make an eye safe. I think Jeffree Star Cosmetics does, but always read your packaging, obviously. Um, I didn't do that, so we're gonna promptly wash this off when we're done, like I said. Okay. It's just these brows, they really um, throw everything off. It's fine. Okay, I think we're gonna do blush next. Posy K, which is kind of close to what I like on my lips. Um, and we're just gonna dab a little bit of this on my cheeks. a trend right now. Hello. Oh god, I should probably start buffing this before it sinks in. Oh no. Come on. Don't dry. Uh, oh no. Oh no. All hope is lost here. Uh, let's just gloss them up. Let's just be crazy, you know? So we're gonna use the Coco Damn Gina. Um, we're gonna put that on our lids and why not just use this as highlighter because it has sprinkles in it. Sprinkles? Yes, that's what I meant. Okay. It's getting in my eyelashes. Oh, okay. I'm not mad at it. I can see it. Like, when I look out, I can see it in my eye hole. That's not ideal. But here we are. I feel like glossy eyes are having a moment right now anyway, so. Okay. Let's just do this for some highlight. Boom. 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 Oh, okay. You see it? Oh, okay. Mm hmm. Think finally, lips. I'm going to use my holy grail product. Wait, no, forgot. Mascara first, JK. I'm using the Milk Kush Mascara, which I really like. It has marijuana in it. Wow, I'm not mad. Okay, like I said, I'm gonna be using my, I gotta stop saying holy grail, that's annoying. This is the lipstick that I literally wear like every single day. I'm so annoying about it. It's the Sephora Cream Lip Stain in Marvelous Mauve. Um, I think it's number 13. I feel like this is like universally flattering. It looks good on everyone. I think I grabbed one of my empty ones. I bought this like four times now. Uh, it's just so pretty. I love that the one I grabbed for like the thing that it's actually used for is the shittiest one that I own. If that makes sense. Um, and just because we're trying to use as many products as we can, might as well top that off with a little bit of gloss in the center. Again, with Damn Gina. So this is the finished look. I'm doing that awkward like beauty YouTuber thing where I try and look posy without looking posy, you know? 
Honestly, I'm not mad at the eyes. I really do like the gloss. I think I'm gonna try that more in my makeup, um, but I'm probably gonna try and find like a gloss that's like eye safe, because I don't think this one is. Um, yeah, I really don't mind it. Like I said at the beginning of this video, I'm kind of um, evolving my channel a little bit. Um, my very exciting announcement, which is might not be exciting to anyone else, but is very exciting to me. Um, I am officially moving from Canada to Australia in September. So it's April right now. So in like five, look at what I just found. <laughs> look at this fucking cat hair ball. You little shit. Look at this, that's disgusting. I am moving to Australia. I'm moving to Melbourne specifically. Um, eventually I'll learn how to say that properly once I move down there. Um, I'm moving with some friends that I uh, worked with at Disney, which is super exciting. I can't wait. Um, I'm gonna start making videos about that, basically what the visa process is like for Canadians versus Americans. Um, I, of course, as a Canadian, um, we're part of the Commonwealth, so the visa process is a bit different than it is for Americans, and my other two friends that are going are American. Um, so I've kind of seen what their process is and mine. It's actually technically two different visas. So I'm gonna be making videos about that, about packing, about travel, whatever. Uh, whatever you wanna see about that, definitely let me know. I always say this at the end, like, leave a comment. No one does, it's fine. Um, this is mostly just for me. Um, so yeah, that's my special, exciting, fun announcement. I hope you liked this video. It was fun to film. It was like just a little quick one, hopefully. Um, so yeah, again, if you like it, let me know. I definitely want to still do things like this. Um, I hope you guys have an excellent weekend, day, year, life, YOLO, yeet. Um, and I will see you in the next video, okay? I mean, oh,